Munyain the focus of attention. Three goals in his last three matches, and you can't argue with that sort of form. We'll have the action on EA TV. And this is the scene here in Leverkusen ahead of this match. We're at the Bay Arena. I'm Derek Ray on the commentary gantry and delighted to be joined as always by Stuart Robson. And the focus is on the Bundesliga. Live action coming up. It's Bayer Leverkusen facing Borussia Dortmund. Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly, hitting the opposition back, playing the ball forward and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully, we get a really good game here. And here's the 11 for Borussia Dortmund. Niklas Zule starts with Mats Hummels in central defence. Mahmoud Dahoud starts alongside Emre Can in the centre of midfield. And the striker of choice is the powerful and lethal Sebastian Allaire. Well, I believe changing circumstances in the Bayern match. Alex Scott, who has scored? It's a goal for Bayern Munich. They've scored the opener with six minutes played. Just the start they would have wanted. Back to you, Derek. Alex, thank you very much. Well, if you're looking for a player to decide a game, look no further than Munyain. Stuart, what do you think we might see from him? Well, Derek, we know he loves linking up with other players, but it's when he's in and around the penalty area, that's when he's at his most dangerous, when he plays little one-twos around his marker and then plays the next forward Hang pass. on a minute, Stuart. Opportunity unfolding. Oh, a vital piece of last-ditch defending. Just can't seem to get out of their own half, and that's down to the pressure. That's a well-struck pass. Munyain. Well, that is how to nullify the opposition. Well, for Bayern Leverkusen, you have to conclude everything went to plan in their win against Bochum. What do you expect this time, Stuart? Yeah, winning a tight game 1-0 away from home is always a good result. They certainly worked hard for it. Today, we'll follow a similar pattern, and I expect them to win by the odd goal. Well, the attacking options appear plentiful. Ezequiel Palacios. A chance to whip it in. Slipshod passing. Could be troublesome. Tapsova. Palacios on the ball. Clean challenge. And over the touchline for what will be a Dortmund throw. As those stats tell us, Leverkusen have enjoyed more of the ball, but their attacking players lack tempo, invention and goal. Something they need to rectify quickly if they're going to win this one. Well, first things first, they need the ball again. Can they forge ahead? Oh, he really bruised the crossbar. Well, he made great contact with that one, but the goalkeeper had his own ideas. Now, sending it in. That'll be a Bayer Leverkusen throw. Lorian Wirtz. Diaby. And the pass over hit. A creative look about this. He must finish. Good stop from the keeper. Well, just listen to these fans. They're urging their team to score here and take the lead. And the play stop. They will make the change now. 
and played short. Well, the danger is still there. Threat over for now, it seems. So, half time, closing. So the two teams have switched around and the second half is underway. Effective challenge. Oh, big chance. Well, he was on his own, but couldn't take advantage of it. Well, I'm not surprised he missed that. He never really looked in complete control, did he? Palacios. And here's Belarabi. Tah. Now with Tapsoba. Well, I'm hearing there's been a goal in the Bayern game. Alex Scott can fill us in. Yep, it's a goal for Eintracht Frankfurt. It's all even Stevens at 1-1 with 53 minutes played. They've been fast out of the blocks here in the second half, Derek. Cheers, Alex. A real opening now. Royce with others close by. Well, nothing comes of the attack when all is said and done. Well, Chelsea have been busy in the transfer market, and the contract situation has been ironed out. We could see him in action pretty oh, soon. Derek, what a moment this could be. And there it is, the opening goal, 1-0, and they'll feel they deserve it. Well, let's look at this again. To pick out this pass shows wonderful vision. It's inch perfect, and his movement's so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one thought in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. Well, back underway here, and a wake-up call for Borussia Dortmund, you would think. And so 30 minutes left for play in this one. Well, a pity that. It looked promising, but that's going to be claimed by the keeper. Edmond Tapsoba. Karim Belarabi. Palacios on the ball. Diaby. Florian Wirtz. Moving the ball nicely, looking for that final pass. It was always likely to be the goalkeeper's ball. Gertrauda into the final 20 minutes Muniain the ball with Marco Royce but it stopped a promising attack in its tracks and you wouldn't be surprised if there's a card coming out here Making sure nothing untoward happened. On the cusp of the final whistle, and they're making home advantage count, but only just. Stuart, your thoughts? Well, they need to hold on here. Not long left now, but you have to say they've defended really well up to this point, and I just can't see them conceding now. This will be a really good win if it stays like this. Now they've lost it. Diaby being edged on by the crowd well a poor effort when all was said and done and simple for the keeper well he's made a real mess of that hasn't he what a chance that was they've got to be really mindful of the time situation attacking though they might be that's the kind of shielding play you expect from him Munyain Able to get a body in the way. And there! Oh, a great chance it was. Goalkeeper has it. Now, from what I'm hearing, there's been a goal in the Bayern Munich game. Over to Alex for the information. Yeah, it's a goal for Bayern. They pulled one back with 85 minutes played. Entertaining stuff so Oh, wait a minute. Could be in here.
Oh, good work by the keeper. Time is not on the side. This corner could help the prospects as they look for an equaliser. And not the best clearance. And there. And that will be that. The referee's whistle for full time. Maximum points for Bayer Leverkusen. Thank you everyone for coming, thank you. Can we take your seats and we'll start getting the questions in now. Thank you very much for attending. It is opening night, a huge night for both sets of fans. Match day one in the UEFA Champions League. Who will get off to a flying start? Stay tuned, we'll have all the action for you live here on EA TV. Hello, a warm welcome to the western part of Germany. We find ourselves in the city of Leverkusen. I'm Derek Ray at the microphone, and joining me for match commentary is Stuart Robson. And what we have for you tonight is live Champions League group stage match day one action. It's Bayer Leverkusen up against Club Rouge. Well, thanks, Derek. This is such an important game. Both sides will be desperate to start this group well. Let's hope we see some great football today. Kerem Demirbay. Skov Olsen. Always difficult to predict in advance who might decide a game, but you could make a strong case for this man, I think, Stuart. What are you expecting to see from him? 
well, Derek. Over the years, he's scored so many goals. It's his ability to come short and then spin in behind defenders at such pace. When the ball's played in behind, nobody catches him, and he often gets 1v1 against the goalkeeper, and we know what the result is. Diaby. Oh, great vision. Must be. Well, we can see it again now, and it all starts with the pass over the top. It takes out so many defenders. And then just look at this finish, Derek. He does so well to read the bounce. Often you can send these into row Z, but he makes the perfect contact. Stunning goal, really. And back underway. 1-0 it is. Using his physical strength to shield it. And they continue to advance. And a lot of options here. Well, not making life difficult for the keeper at all. A wide attempt. Frimpong. And we're receiving news of a goal in the Porto match. Alex Scott, what can you tell us? It's a goal for Atletico Madrid. They're the first on the score sheet here with 21 minutes played. Thanks as always, Alex. Ezequiel Palacios. In the right place to cut out the pass. Nielsen. Ritz. Kasper Nielsen. Van Aken. Well, pass after pass. Maybe they can chisel an opportunity. And the cross not sufficiently well played in. And a big moment because the referee has pointed to the spot. Penalty coming up. And now to level the game. The keeper going in the right direction and saving it. Trying to pick out a teammate. Not really the ideal clearance. Well, they can bring it out now. Adli. No space for them here. Delivering it into the box. And the danger's still on. Well, they would have been disappointed had he spilled that one. Good pressure to win the ball back high up the pitch. Not troubling the keeper. Lang. He quartered the attack illegally. Uh, perhaps a card is forthcoming. Well, the referee has decided to book him. Well, it's not a good challenge, and quite rightly, he gets a yellow card for that. A goal! Real excitement! A back-and-forth type of game. Now they're level. So underway again here on the back of that leveller. Florian Wirtz. Palacios on the ball. Real chance. And it's in! They're back in front. Stunning scenes here. Well, here's the replay, and it's a really good bit of play. Watch how he turns his marker and then has the composure to finish. That's a top-class goal. So there we have it, 2-1. 
So one minute of stoppage time. That's what the officials have said. And no more time left. That concludes the first half here at the... And so the second half of this Champions League group stage match day one contest commences. A very good tackle. And do they mean business on this occasion? A fine reading of the situation. Viet. Well, this is a story we've been following, and now I'm told the T's have been crossed and the I's dotted. Marco Asensio has completed his move to Manchester City. Well, the reported fee of around £35 million represents a really good deal for them. He's talented, yes, but he's also a really top-class professional. And that attitude will rub off on some of those players around him, that's for sure. Palacios. Viet. Oh, he's given us away. Nielsen. Noah Lang. Well, they're on the scent of something positive. He must finish. Oh, that's a fine save. Who can they pick out? Crucial intervention just then amid impending danger. In the opinion of the referee, that is a penalty. Chance to even things up here. And confidently convert it. Well, when you see this again, what a good penalty it is. He threatens to hit it with power, just puts his toe underneath the ball and dinks it down the middle. You've got to have a lot of courage to play like that. So back underway, the game having been squared at 2-2. And it really should be an intriguing Bundesliga game, the one we've got coming up for you here on EA TV. It's oh, back. Derek, big moment here. Well, quite simply, not precise enough from that position. And they've been getting two substitutes warmed up, and both will come on here. Jeremy Frimpong. Florian Wirtz and intercepts again and the emphasis is on creativity he's got to score oh the keeper made it look routine it was anything but well a chance here perhaps to invigorate their aerial targets plattered away well that effort was always going wide he's not going to be best pleased with himself Andri. Palacios on the ball. Florian Wirtz. An effective challenge. Excellent vision. Not going to get away with that because it's offside here. And he shouldn't be offside there. He's gone too early. And that's a waste of a great opportunity. Frimpong. Really sitting deep now. That could be problematic. Ezequiel Palacios. Jonathan Tarr has it. Right, I'm hearing in my ear there's been a change to the scoreline at the Estadio do Dragao. So that means we join Alex Scott. And it's another goal for Atletico Madrid. They've pulled ahead by three with ten minutes left on the clock. 
Many thanks, Alex. Well, forward they go again. Can they win this? That'll be a Leverkusen ball. Florian Wirtz. And just five minutes remaining. Plenty of forward momentum here, but can they produce? And using his strength to shield the ball. Body in the way. Chance, maybe. But it looks so threatening, but the danger averted. Andri. Well, totaling up all the stoppages, we'll have two additional minutes. And threading it forward, and he's through. Well, here it is again. The through ball is absolutely inch perfect, and his movement's so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one foot in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. So, full time it is, and a morale boosting three points on the board to begin their European campaign. Well, you always want to get off to a good start, and that's exactly what they've done here. Now they can look forward to the next game. They're in a great position. And hello, talking to you today from a football stadium that really could pass for a museum, the Olympiastadion in the German capital, Berlin. I'm your man.
Hello, a warm welcome to the western part of Germany. We find ourselves in the city of Leverkusen. My name is Derek Ray, excited to be bringing you match commentary. And alongside me, my broadcasting partner, Stuart Robson. And very much looking forward to bringing you live action from the Bundesliga in a matter of moments. It's Bayer Leverkusen up against Schalke. Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. Real chance, but can't avail himself of the chance. Will he be disappointed with that? Maybe it's just come a bit too early for him. Well, on paper, this is a very difficult assignment for the visitors. Not only do they have the worst return in front of goal this season, but they face the stingiest back line in the league. Well, Derek, they're going to struggle to break this back line down, aren't they? Unless they show more enterprise. They've been far too cautious in previous games. They need to get more players forward and into oh, the Stuart, box. Oh, they could be in here. And a goal! An early boost for them. The first goal of the game. Well, here it is again, and just look how he turns away from his marker and then gets his shot away. That's a very good goal, you have to say. So the match has restarted, 1-0 here. And a scoring update to bring you from the Rhein Energie Stadion. Alex Scott. Yep, yeah, it's a goal for Eintracht Frankfurt. It's all even Stevens at 1-1 with 13 minutes played. Thanks as always, Alex. Frey. This is looking threatening. He could pick out a teammate. Can he finish? Well, such a high degree of difficulty. Not quite in the end. Well, how good was that? It's such a difficult piece of skill, which he made look so easy. That deserved a goal. Wirtz. Palacios on the ball. Florian Wirtz. Andri. Oh, that's a really good run. Well, danger averted thanks to his teammate. Marius Bülter. Spot on with that tackle. Going well. Ben Arabi. Options in the middle. And can they make one of these passes count? They just couldn't play that decisive ball. So almost at half time, and they are making good use of home advantage. Still a bit of work to do, though. Stuart, your thoughts on what you've seen? Well, it's been a tight game so far, but they've just had that little bit more quality on the ball, particularly in midfield, where they've just started to take control. They'll be fairly happy going in at half time if it stays like this. Eder Balanta. Well, let's see if something comes of this. He must finish! And a goal to square the game! Edge of the seat stuff. So, a level contest. 1-1. One, one. And out of play for a Schalke throw. Tower. Costa. Giving the ball to the opposition that time. Well, the first half story has been written. It's half time here at the Bay Arena.
And as the second half commences, both sides can reflect on a first half in which they were so very evenly matched. Has the strength to hang on to it. Can he put them in front? Oh, fine stop. Well, let's join Alex Scott because I'm hearing there's been a goal in the Union match. It's a goal for Leipzig. They've pulled one back and now trail by one with 51 minutes played. Alex with the info as ever. Thumps clear. And reading it absolutely superbly. Now let us point you in the direction of Champions League group stage action coming up live here on EA TV. It's Bayer Leverkusen against Atletico. That should be a tasty encounter. Plenty of quality in those two sides. Certainly one to enjoy. Well, Leverkusen, as you can see, have enjoyed so much possession. But it's been a frustrating performance from them so far. They just haven't had enough guile in the final third. It's all been a bit too predictable, which has to change if they want to win this one. Well, first things first, they need the ball again. A very effective challenge put in. Well, the attacking options appear plentiful. It might be the moment to get them ahead. In it goes! But wait a minute, that will not count. Well, that was tight, but he was just offside. It was a good finish, though. And straight out of play off the keeper's boot. It will be a throw in. Florian Wirtz. Andri. And support available, but quick thinking defensively. A live game from the Bundesliga for you to look forward to here on EA TV. It's Schalke versus Bochum. Well, Derek, I'm really looking forward to it. Always a great atmosphere in that stadium, and it should be an entertaining match. And the timing was perfect. Ball one. Frey. Plenty of options. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. Now we're inside the final quarter of an hour now. Andri. And winning it back. Mohamed Madi Kamara. Careless in possession. Leverkusen continuing on the front foot. Can they break through? Karim Bellarabi. He read the situation. defensively and did his job five minutes to go and out of play for a Leverkusen throw in and the substitution will occur now well I'm getting word that something important has happened in the Union Berlin game Alex Scott can provide us with the details it's another goal for Leipzig. They're back in this now with 88 minutes on the clock. Alex, thank you very much. There will be one minute added on at the end. And that is going to be all for this game. Well, we were treated to goal.